I'm Tom Doyle from Springdale Floors and Greenhouses in Darien, Connecticut. Not a big company, but I'm three generations now. And uh, most of my ideas about business the last three years have been about survival, not about growing my business, because I've known that that uh, the, the, I lost about 20% of my business in the last three years. I depend on the twenty, thirty, forty dollars that people have in their pockets when they drive by my place um, to pick up flowers. I'm a garden center. I have different other things that I do. I sell Christmas trees. We have all that. But I depend on the little bit of money that people have in their pocket. My main competitor used to be the garden center up the street. Lately, it feels like the government is my competition. I worked real hard not to lay people off because I thought this was temporary. I have about 10 people that work for me full time. Worked real hard because I consider them all part of my family. We didn't lay anybody off. And then I get a bill from the state saying I have to contribute to the unemployment. I worked. It's not my fault. I worked real hard to keep these people on. We started manufacturing. I started doing things that my great grandfather did to stay to during the depression to, because my business has survived the depression and I did a lot of things and I became prof a little bit of profit I ran last year I had to give it all back my my goal was to take over the family business now God forbid if something happens to uh, my parents I'll have to get rid of the business to pay the taxes that I'll need to, to survive it because we don't have the, the the money or the resources to pay fancy people the money it takes to get around all these laws and all these taxes. I'm still working hard, but I'm working hard to survive. We're trying hard to regain some of our business, but every time someone, you can't keep taxing people. You can't keep pulling it out of their pockets. The gas prices, the fuel prices, the heating prices in this state are phenomenal. When this whole recession first started, um, people were coming in, and I was really inspired by, hey, I want to I I support my local business. That came and went, because now I'm getting, oh, I bought it on the Internet. Oh, I bought it on this. Somebody can come, come to my door and ask prices for flowers, and I could quote them prices, and they can go home and go on the Internet. And buy the flowers on the, inter on the internet tax free and get it sent to my flower shop and I'll have to deliver it. I want to hire people. I want to get bigger. But it's so hard just to commend, just to take the business I have right now. It's hard. Margins are tight. Products are going up. People aren't willing to spend money so you, you, your product prices are going up. and. It, it's just a tough environment out there. I don't mind being competitive with the guy up the street, but I need everybody to stop taking the 20 30 40 50 dollars that a family has to spend in my place and giving it to the government. It's a tough, tough environment, and that's, uh, that's what I have to say. Thank you very much. Thank you.